what is up my beautiful youtube family welcome to the hack buster channel guys this is the show where you find random life hacks from the internet and we see how reliable and realistic they are today we're gonna do some designer shirt imprinting life hacks so let's get started Do you think that is going to stick on the shirt as clear as they show? First of all, they used a paper to stick in there. But in their actual completed shirt, it didn't look like there was a piece of paper in there at all. It looked like it was actually printed on the shirt. I don't think it's going to work at all. But if you've seen my other videos, you know I'm not always right. I'm most of the time wrong. So let's see if this hack actually works. I really hope it does because I have so many things I can print out and put it on my shirt. So let's hope for the best. Alright, so I've been ironing this for about two to three minutes right now. So let's see if that did anything at all. Nope. If you saw my previous video, if you try to laminate, this actually looks much better quality for laminating with the wrapping paper instead of any thicker paper at all. But as for sticking to the shirt itself, this is definitely not going to stick at all. That paper is not even melted a little bit. And even if it was to melt, you could still see the paper versus the shirt. They are highly distinguishable. Yeah, this one is definitely busted. I'm sorry guys, you guys will not be able to just print out a design of your choice from the internet and iron it to your shirt. It doesn't work like that. Let's see our next genius hack. I think this one actually have a lot higher chance of being real because bleach will ruin the color and this one should work. So I have high hopes for this one. Let's see if it works. All right guys, so for this one, I'm going to bleach out this awesome looking owl right here. As you can see, it did work. With this one, there isn't really much that can go wrong unless you have like fake bleach or something. Other than that, I pretty much knew that this was gonna work and it should work like it did. I really wanted to try this on. Although you cannot imprint design in your shirts, you can definitely cut out this design and bleach over your black shirt to have that design on your shirt. I'm really happy with this one. I'm glad it worked. So this one is a thumbs up. Let's see our last hack of the day. So we had the first one that was completely busted. Second one worked. I'm so happy for that. Let's see the third one if it's going to be busted or real or plausible. Does that person ever have a plan of washing that shirt at all? Because if you wash that shirt, all of that crayon is going to come right off. So only do this hack if you have a shirt that you want to get rid of and wear it for the last time. But I think it is going to be successful as well. Let me know what you think in the comments below. As you guys can see, they did melt it. So now the concern is if any of the crayons is actually going to come off with this paper or is all of them going to stay? I don't think I can wash this shirt ever again because if I wash it, all of these crayons is going to come off and probably ruin all my other clothes, including my washer. I let it sit for a while, so it's pretty dry right now. Time for the reveal. See if it actually does stick. Alright, so as you can see, it did work. It does look pretty awesome. If you wear this, make sure you don't live in a hot temperature area such as Florida because then it's going to be melting off your shirt, which can be a, another cool design. 
you are into that. But as you can see in this area right here, some of the crayons did come off into the parchment papers. So this one as you can see after drying along with the other parts where the paint actually come off, when you wear it and it gets wrinkled a little bit, you know how when you drip candles on your skin and you pinch it, the whole thing comes off? This is exactly the same concept. Let me show you. You see? Along with this messing up your other clothes and messing up your dryer and melting off, this is not reliable either because it's eventually also going to come right off. This one I'm going to say is plausible and rated 4 out of 10 because although it does look cool, it is very very temporarily unless you mess up while taking it off, then it does not even look cool and you pretty much ruined your shirt. So as you saw from the 3 life hacks that we did today, the first one was a complete total busted, the second one definitely worked like it should and the third one it is plausible because although it does look temporarily cool, it does not last and you can never wash it. So if you see any life hack that you think is really interesting and you want to try out for yourself and have some curiosity if it's going to really work or not, definitely send me the link of the video in the comments below and I will test it out for you guys. If you like this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family so they also know which life hack is actually real and which one is fake. Thank you so much for giving your valuable time to watch my videos guys. To see my last video, click right here. To see another iron life hacks, click right here. And do not forget, this is the most important one, definitely make sure to click this subscribe button right here, which is my face. Click my face. Thank you so much guys. Peace.